Hillbilly DVD Reviews Unboxing Series. Today, we got it out of the blue, 10 years after its release, but it came out Steelbook version of Starsky and Hush. It's a German edition from this new Steelbook collection that Studio Canal or somebody is doing out of uh, Germany, I guess. And what's interesting about these is uh, there's no rhyme or reason, but they have them numbered. Like this one's number 8. I have a few other ones in the collection, like The Mechanic, Pulp Fiction, Jackie Brown. And you're probably saying, well, how come you ain't showing us Pulp Fiction and shit? Well, hey, motherfucker, they all can't be winners, okay? So today is fucking Starsky and Hutch Day, okay? Alright. Got the shrink wrap off. Got the fucking dirty-ass rating sticker off. So here we go. Here's the front. I really like this whole series. You know, some people don't like these type of things where they all come out with the, like a similar background. But the whole s series of this Steelbook collection, they have a black background with the artwork. Shot. I think it looks cool. I think it looks eye popping. And even though the other movies in the collection don't have much to do with each other, even, even still, if you just put these on a shelf next to each other, they look badass. So here we have the front. Silly ass motherfuckers. You got the side. Very basic. But still nice, has the logo. On the back here we have the description of the movie. It's all in German, of course, except for one line from the movie. It says, In Bay City, when you cross the line, you nuts are mine. Oh yeah, fucking Starsky and Hutch. Badass motherfucker. Well, not really. This, this movie's pretty fucking corny. But whatever. So let's pop it open see what we got. Oh, we got a lot of fucking advertisements. Blur rays. Yorkshire Killer. I've not heard of this movie, but it looks... Hey, it's fucking Spider-Man with some 70 cyborgs playing a killer motherfucker. I have to look this up on Netflix or some shit. Oh, here we go with the Steelbook Collection. Real quick with the Steelbook Collection. See, these are some of the other movies on the list here. Fucking uh, Apocalypse Now. They had one. Jack the Brown, like I said. Pulp Fiction. Mr. and Mrs. Smith. The Tourist. Uh, Unknown Identity, which is, I think, just unknown here. The Mechanic, I have that one. Kiss and Kill, Lash and Kutcher, and I guess that's what it's called over there. Here it's just called Killers. But anyway, got the disc, nice picture disc. As you can see, it is Region B lock. They put it right on Front Street right there. And on the inside, usually with these older movies that come out, budget release, there's no inside artwork, but they went all out on this one. You got Huggy Bear and this version of Starsky Hutch played by fucking Snoop Dogg, fucking playing a half ass pimp. But hey, PG-13, I guess they couldn't get away with much. This is one of the Todd Phillips sellout movies when he stopped making r movies before he came back to do The Hangover, but whatever. I like it, man. I think it's a cool steel look. Even though I don't dig this movie that much, I will give it another watch finally just because I have it on the shelf now. Starsky and Hutch, man. Corny motherfuckers. Owen Wilson, Ben Stiller. Really ain't been funny in fucking probably 10 years, but hey, what, what can you say, man? They're still cranking the movies out.